What's up, everybody? It's your boy Dion J. Lewis here with another installment of my blog, Hashtag Awesome, and I hope y'all are ready for it. So I was at work the other night, right? And I was thinking, what should my second blog really be about, you know? The year just started, so I'm not really doing too much yet other than I just started up my classes again. But nothing has really happened yet. So I was like, what should I talk about? So then it dawned on me. 2012 is the year that I started putting out dance videos again. Week after week. Because I took a break because I lost my laptop. So once I got it back, you know, I was like, let me start making videos again. Because I was seeing some amazing videos. And I was like, well, I want to be one of those amazing videos. So I started making videos again. So what I decided to do with this vlog here is to do a countdown kind of of my top favorite videos that I put out last year. So let's just go ahead and get this started. So my fifth favorite video that I put out this year is actually a D-Day video. And it was to a dubstep remix of a Linkin Park song, Burn It Down. And it was really fun to make because the whole concert we had about it, it was like, you know, we were just outside and we were like dancing outside and we saw a sewer and we was like, you know, it would be funny if like you stepped on a sewer and, you know, it was making you dance and had, you know, magic clouds, blah, 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 whatever. So we decided to make a video around it. And so what we did was we had the lights go in and out. Like whenever we were dancing on the sewer, you know, the color would come in and whenever we stepped off it, it would be black and white. So that would have to definitely be my fifth place video that I put out last year. Number four would have to be my Halloween video that I put out this year because that was very interesting to me because it was a song I found by another guy who's on YouTube named Ali Tominik. And when I heard this song and seen a video, I was like, dude, I have to make a dance video to it. But Halloween wasn't nowhere near, so I found that song way earlier in the year, but I really couldn't do nothing with it because I really wanted to save it for Halloween. So, what I did was, I just put it to the side, kept the song. I didn't listen to the song too much, so I wouldn't get tired of it, though. But it turned out really good, and the concept was like, you know, good versus evil. You had two sides. You know, one side of me dancing was very, you know, you know, light, and the other one was kind of more like real hard or whatever. And then my clothes were switching and everything, so it was really fun. So I just really enjoyed making that video. Number three in my spot would have to be Geek in the Pink, another D-Day video that we did for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. The reason being because yes, it had a message and it was you know out there to support breast cancer awareness but at the same time it was just so much fun we were being goofy having a lot of fun we put a little choreography in it but it was more like freestyle choreography where only certain parts was choreographed but it was really fun and we shot it in front of this church and it was funny when people drive by and they watch you the whole time when you're dancing but that video it turned out really good and so I have to definitely say that takes my number three spot for 2012. Number two Okay, so I thought really long and hard about number two, and because it was a lot of videos I actually put out this year, and I didn't realize how many I put out until I was doing this countdown, but number two was the video I did to Brandenburg, and this, the reason why, because this video was different from all my other videos, because this video was a lot, three different live performances made into one performance, which means, you know, I just took the three the dance I did three different times and put them in order with the music so it's just like one long dance but it was in three different areas from three different point of views and it was to like I said Brandenburg which was a mixture between classical and hip-hop music so it's it's different from a lot of the other videos and music I dance to anyway so that would have to take number two because of the uniqueness that was behind it and okay so here it is number one my number one favorite video that I put out in 2012. Are you ready for it? All right, wait a second. Okay, number one video that I put out in 2012. It has to be my hometown glory bit because that bit was just so good to me you know and apparently it was good to everybody else because out of all my videos I put out it had the most views in one day and the most views out of all the videos that I put out in 2012 like in the first day it got over a thousand views easy so I was like oh wow that's pretty awesome so I was real happy about that one 
and that is now my third most viewed video on YouTube behind my There Goes My Baby vid and my D-Day Hot Toddy vid. So definitely go check Hometown Glory out because like I said, it's my number one video of 2012. The outfit, the background, everything, the musicality in it, it was just so good to me and I got so much positive feedback on that one alone. So I feel that Hometown Glory definitely takes the number one spot of vids that I put out in 2012. So like I said, definitely go check that out and also go check out all the other vids if you haven't seen them yet or if you have seen them, just go watch them again. I guarantee you they're going to be just as good the second time or third time or fourth time or fifth time. I said fifth time. So that you watch them. Okay? So I hope y'all enjoyed that. Like I said, this is the second installment of my vlog. Hashtag awesome. And as the year goes on, there'll be more and more stuff in it and more and more stuff I have to say. But right now, all I gotta say is follow me on Twitter at Dion underscore J underscore Lewis. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Mr. DJ Lou92. And like me on Facebook, like the D Day page on Facebook. And also, you can check out the D Day website at ddaydances.com. All the links will be at the bottom in the description, so go check that out. Check out all the videos that I put up, the top five videos that I put up. And just enjoy the rest of your week, enjoy the rest of your day, enjoy the rest of your life. So, yeah, it's your boy, DeAndre Lewis, but I'm about to leave y'all, so stay awesome. What's up, everybody? It's your boy Dion J. Lewis here with another installment of my vlog. Hashtag awesome. So I was like, Shut up, And there's another, my fifth favorite video that I put out this year is actually a D-Day video to a dubstep remix of a Lincoln Park song called Burn It to the Ground. And it was done with, of course, me and Damon. The video, but it was fun, you know. But like, it is always fun dancing with my dance partner because he's really retarded. And just enjoy the rest of your week, enjoy the rest of your day, enjoy the rest of your life, you know, because we only get one. That's my yellow, that's so lame. Oh my god, I can't believe I just said that. Hold up.